Hello everyone. In today's video, we will explain how to create a short storybook for kids using Canva and ChatGPT or Google Gemini. Let's get started. In the first step, we will create a short story using ChatGPT or Google Gemini. Let's first generate a short story through ChatGPT. Visit and ask ChatGPT to write a short story for kids to learn about seasons. As you can see, it creates a beautiful story, but it is long. Just ask ChatGPT to make it shorter, and you'll see that ChatGPT shortens the story. Now, let's try with Google Gemini. Visit the Google Gemini website and ask it to write a short story for kids to learn about seasons. As you can see, it creates a great story, but it's long. Ask it to make it a little bit shorter, and you'll see that Google Gemini shortens the story. Next, select one story from the ChatGPT and Google Gemini versions. Navigate to the Canva website and enter Storybook in the search box. Numerous templates are available, but we'll be creating a new one from scratch. Click on the Create a Blank Storybook option. Select the page and customize the background color to your preference. Next, we'll add frames to place pictures on each page related to our story. Click on Elements in the left side menu, then scroll down and click on See All in the Frames section. Scroll down again and click on See All in the Blob section. Choose a frame shape from the list and drag and drop it onto the page. Add a heading label to this page by copying the story title from ChatGPT or Google Gemini and pasting it in the heading. Adjust the font of the title and the font size according to your preference. Adjust the text label accordingly. Add a new page, then include a frame for an image. Adjust the frame to fit the screen's appearance. Add a text label to this page, change the text as needed, copy it from ChatGPT and paste it here. Adjust the label and font settings accordingly. Repeat this process for every new page until you complete the entire story. Place storylines and frames on each page in an appropriate manner. Now, the next step is to add decoration to the pages. Open the elements from the left side menu and search for kids season in the search box. Add one of these cute graphics, then right click on it and select the layer option. Afterward, choose the send backward option to place the graphic behind the text and image frame. Set the transparency of this graphic to 35. Now, Search for Caterpillar in Elements and add one from the list of cute graphics. Adjust its position accordingly. Set the transparency of this graphic to 41. You can change the color of the title for clear visibility against the background. Move to the next page, search for Kids Season again and select another cute graphic from the list. Adjust its position and send it backward. Set the transparency of this graphic to 35. Search for a butterfly and choose a design from the list. Adjust the butterfly's position and set its transparency to 47. Add another butterfly and make necessary adjustments. Continue this process for each page, making changes to the text for clear visibility against the background. Repeat this process until you have made changes to all pages. Now, the next step is to create images related to our story page and then place them in frames on these pages. To do so, click on Apps in the left side menu. Scroll down and select the Magic Media app. If you cannot find it here, search for it in the above search box. The Magic Media app will create images based on our text prompt. So, write the text prompt here and select a style for the output image. Now, click on the Generate Image button. It will create four images. 
Select one from the images and place it in the frame like this. Repeat this process for every page, creating images through the Magic Media app and then place them in the image frame on the related page. As you can see, we have successfully completed creating the storybook. To turn this story into a flip book, click on the share button at the top. Now, click on the more option. Scroll down and select the simple booklet flip option in the design section. Open the app, log in using your Google account and click on the export your design button. Select all pages and click on the save button. It will prepare the booklet design for your story. You can check the book by clicking on the view in simple booklet flip option. Give a title to your booklet and then click on the convert button. It will take a moment to create the booklet. As you can see, the storybook has been created successfully. Now, we can turn the pages in a beautiful way like this. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching.